Oh no, 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 no. I don't know what to do here. Earthbound? Yeah. Yeah, kind of. Migosp crawled up close. Uh, so his name's yellow already, so I can already spare him. Wait, what do you do? You're dancing. What the heck? <laughs> Doesn't have a care in the world. Oh, wait. Can I spare him now? Oh, okay, that was easy. He just had to dance a little bit. I don't know what those three switches do. Wait, there's, they're everywhere. Oh, jeez. No! Where did I fall? Okay, I'm back up here. How in the world? Is there like... Does this tell me? If you can read this, press the blue switch. Uh -huh. Ah! Okay, spare you. You're gonna dance. Look at him. Got the little arm thing going. And now I can spare you. Alright. It's so easy sparing things because you don't have to worry about long drawn out battles. You tell me nothing happened, but the wall obviously told me to press the blue switch. It lied. You lied to me. How dare you! How dare you! Where I have to keep pressing it. What about you? Nothing happened. Whoa. Oh, battle. Okay. Spare. Swing your arms! I'm confused. You noticed there was a blue switch behind the top pillar. I should have figured there was a switch hidden somewhere. Uh, let's see. If you can read this, press the red switch. Sweet. I can read it. Would he hurt me if I went to him? Probably. Probably. It's a switch. Yes. Alright. Progress. I need a sign telling me which button to press. Press the green switch. Well, I don't know which one's green. It's there. Yeah! Dance! Shake it! Alright, which one is green? This one? Nope! You put me all the way back here. Wow. Okay. Please don't tell me I have to knock the switches again. Okay. I Whoa! No donations Thanks, man. Really appreciate that. Wasn't necessary. Very kind. Thank you. I'm trying to rock. Hopefully I'm making this entertaining for you guys. I haven't had any characters to voice in a while, but that's because they're just not here. Maybe the switch is back here. Yes! I got it. Alright. And I'm in the fight again. Oh! Um, I don't want to fight. I want to act on veggie, talk dinner. Offers a healthy meal. Legion, we are legion! Yeah, I'm sorry. I... My computer sucks with volume type things. I'm getting destroyed in this game. Now he's gonna dance! Never care in the world, okay. Spare. Let's get out of here. Is that, uh... Oh, nice. My HP was maxed out. Sweet! There's something going on up here. Something's going on. Okay, that's probably the way I need to go, so let's go this way. Let's make sure there's no odd ends here. Ribbit, Ribbit, it's just between you and me. I saw Toriel come out of here just a little while ago. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too intimidated to talk to her, isn't it? Whoa. I found a toy knife. Uh, it's, a, it's a nice shot, though. It looks like a nice city. I think that knife is for 
genocide mode? Because I'm not killing anything in this one that I know of. Oh, here we go. <clears throat> here we go. Goofy voice. Oh, dear. That took longer than I thought it would. Here go. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? Not a scratch. Impressive. But still, I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. Er... Well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. Let's go. Yes, I can save. Seeing such a cute, tidy house in the ruins gives you determination. <laughs> Do you smell that? Surprise! It's a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on snail pie for tonight. Ew, I don't want snail pie ever. Throw that one out. I don't want it. Here, I have a surprise for you. What if we go downstairs? What if we go downstairs? Oh, wait. I wasn't supposed to go there yet, huh? Getting ahead of myself. These books are worn. They must have been read many times. Alright, what's over here? It looks like a nice little plant. Inside is an old calendar from the beginning. I don't know why I'm talking like Goofy. Don't ask. I don't know. I like basically going the wrong way, like any way except the way that she wants me to go. It's a history book. Here's a random page. Trap behind the barrier, fearful and further human attacks. We retreated far, far to the earth we walked until we reached the cavern's end. This was our new home, which we named Home. As great as our king is, he's pretty lousy at names. copies of the same book. Yeah. That's how my library is. Okay. Can I just skip this? The ends of the tools have been filed on to make them safer. Alright. What's up here? Oh! I found pie! What a nice smell. Too hot to eat, though. Stove top is very clean. Must use fire magic. I want fire magic. Guys, you want fire magic? I want fire magic. Oh, that looked weird. I like the change of the music. It's pretty soothing. Hopefully not too soothing. Don't fall asleep on me, guys. This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. Is something burning? I'll make yourself at home. Don't burn the damn pie! I need to eat that. So do I just stay in here? Can I work, walk further down the hall? Miss, wake up. Wake up. Hey. Hey, you. Wake up. Wake up. You have seen this type of plant before, but you don't know its name. I like this room better. It's blue. I want this room. So tired now. Wake up, everybody! Get up! Especially because you work at a chemical plant. Oh, well, yeah, that probably wouldn't be a good thing then. Ah, oh, the cactus. Truly the most sun deer of plants. Soriel's diary. Read the circled passage. Yes. You read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling bonely. Wow. Are we serious with the puns here? The rest of the page is filled with jokes of a similar caliber. <laughs> uh, if this was a Bob Ross room, you'd be out cold by now. <clears throat> well, if you give me a moment, I can, I can, I can take us there. Let me get a paintbrush. I don't have a paintbrush. I ruined my own joke. I don't have a paintbrush. If I did, that would have been pretty freaking funny. Tell you that right now. Peek inside. Scandalous! Storial sock drawer. Oh, okay, yeah, I shouldn't be going through her drawer. Yeah. Flower seeds and some broken crayons. 
Room under renovations. It's me! Yeah, I'd also need like a an afro. You don't need us going all ASMR on us. But I thought you guys liked that. Bob does it all the time. As my chair creaks and ruins the moment. Actually, no, that would probably add to it. Never mind. It's an empty photo frame. It's really dusty. Clean it off. Box of kids' shoes and a disparity of sizes. Oh, that's cool! The music changed! Good night. Lights out. <laughs> it's on after midnight. Oh, 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 boy! I don't know why I did that. That made it sound really, really creepy. I'm sorry. I'm after midnight. <laughs> All right. I can't wait to tune in. I went to sleep and I woke up and there was a piece of pie on the floor. I found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie because I'm an animal and we leave food on the floor for humans. Apparently. Look at these cool toys. They don't interest you at all. <laughs> It's probably about right. I, I think I have to save that pie for later. I don't know. I do have to say the music in this game is pretty epic. Pretty damn cool. It's a fireplace. The fire isn't burning hot, just pleasantly warm. You could put your hand inside. I, I don't think that's a good idea. I'm not gonna do that. Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. Here come. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also... Gosh, the voice, it's running low. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. <laughs> you thought of a new Water Malone character? We bring in Eddie Murphy to be Malone's mentor, Al Apple Foley. <laughs> I swear that needs, that whole segment just needs animated or highlighted or something. I, I hope Bob is doing something with that. That would be awesome. That was such a fun stream. I haven't laughed like that in a while. Oops, I didn't mean to close the game. There we go. But I always wanted to be a teacher, actually. Perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I am glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? What? This? This is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this book I am reading? It is called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? I, like, I feel like... Hmm. If Lixian can animate that segment, I'll lose my mind. Oh, me too, man. Oh, it was so good. And, like, I felt... I felt the jokes kept coming as we were talking. Like, I, I kept laying them left and right. I I guess I wasn't there exactly when it first started, or wasn't really paying attention because I was in-game. And then, I guess somebody in chat started the whole Water Malone thing. And, <laughs> and then, after they started talking about it, I'm like, oh, this is hilarious. Because I'm just picturing, like, a watermelon with a big mustache and all that. Captain Cucumber and Cantalope, Honeydew, all the characters. How about an exciting snail fact? Did you know that snails talk really slowly? Just kidding, the snails don't talk. Interesting. How to exit the ruins. I have to do something, stay here. head hurt after <laughs> yeah it was good it's good times all right I think she's trying to like block off the door here so I'm gonna go find you you wish to know how to return home do you not ahead of us lies the end of the ruins a one-way exit to the rest of the underground I'm going to destroy it no one will ever be able to leave again that sounds creepy 
Now be a good child and go upstairs. Uh, I'm following you. I'm getting out of here. Can't hold me back anymore. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I am only protecting you, do you understand? Go to your room, uncle. Nope. Following your ass. Following your asshole. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. What are you warning me for? I want out of here. You want to leave so badly, humph. Oops, sorry, I think my phone is still somehow probably destroying the mic. I'm gonna put it over here. I think that's Cat retweeting. I doubt that she's able to see this, but if she is, thanks, babe. I appreciate the tweets and the retweets. Humph, you are just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me and you are strong enough to survive. Wait a minute, I'm not supposed to fight her. Couldn't think of any conversation talk. Okay. I'm so screwed here. Tutorial looks through you. Am I actually did I do something wrong? I'm supposed to go out that way no matter what. Try to think of something to say again, but. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to this situation. Well, what am I supposed to do? I'm so dead. I, I suck at this. I have to eat the damn pie. I suck. I, I probably was supposed to keep that until like the end of the game. Oh my gosh, there's no way to hide. What am I supposed to do here? Oh my god. Please stop. Oh, I'm so sucky. I'm gonna die. She's gonna kill me. That, is that supposed to happen? Probably not. Oh, thanks for the host old. I appreciate it, man. That went very quickly. Please don't hurt me. Wait a minute. I noticed something. The more I keep trying to spare her, the more she's not hurting me. Oh. What are you doing? I figured it out. She looks through me. Attack her, run away! <laughs> okay. That is right. Go upstairs. Already? What will it take for you to learn your lesson? Wait. No! I don't want to die! Aw, oh, son of a bitch. Oh, wait. I'm, I'm determined. I don't want to stop. I want to win this. That's right. Go upstairs. Ready? What will it take for you to learn your lesson? I'm stuck, because I don't know what to do. Couldn't think of any conversation topics, son of a bitch. But she's not hurting me anymore. So that's good. I'm not gonna fight her. Because if I kill her, that's not a good thing. Was I supposed to keep sparing her? like going through the same cycle, so I'm gonna try to spare her for a while. Let's see what happens. We'll see. We'll see. I think I have to do like two more times to get back to where I was before. She's not hurting me, so that's the thing. What are you doing, Hungors? I'm sparing you. 
says. You should know this. Attack or run away! She's starting to get like more and more angry. What are you proving this way? Ah, see, she's saying different things. Fight me or leave! Stop it! <laughs> stop it! I don't want to stop. Stop looking at me that way. Oh, I'm breaking her down. I'm breaking her down. Go away. Oh, now it's done. Oh, no, don't tell me that just repeated the cycle. It did, didn't it? No! Wait a minute. Twenty spares later. I know you want to go home, but but what? Try to think of. Oh, I was supposed to spare her again. But please go upstairs now. I promise I will take good care of you here. I know we do not have much, but we can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please go upstairs. The fields are happening right now. Uh oh, she's sad. Haha, <laughs> I'm driving her insane. <laughs> Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. No, I understand. You would just be an unhappy trap down here anyway. The ruins are very small. And you can use them. Blah, 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 blah. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. I know, I know. It's probably transitioning because I'm starting to lose my voice again. I'm trying to, like, get into... I don't want to say it that way. I'm trying to get my voice back in the game. Christopher Walken is for another character down the road who I don't know yet. My loneliness, my fear, and gorge. For you, my child, I will put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Ah, goodbye. Goodbye, my child. I'm glad, because I don't want to do that voice anymore. Bye. Whew. All right, so we got out of there. About time. So happy that's over with. It's getting boring in there. And that butter pie, I mean, it was good. It wasn't worth staying there. Oh no, why is this flower back? <coughs> Clever. Now, why, why, why would the flower be goofy? What voice did I have for the flower? I think it was like, Clever, very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill or be killed. So you were able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. Hee hee hee. I bet you feel real and great. You didn't kill anybody this time. What you'll do if you... What? But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? You'll die and you'll die and you'll die. Until you're tired of dying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Or will you give up entirely? Not to inherit the power to control it. I am the prince of this world's future. Yep, it's Mickey Mouse. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't registered. This is so much more interesting. <laughs> you are evil little... Evil little flower, you are. And so it's happened. I went through the portal. <gasps> Next time on Undertale.